You've gotten quite a few good outings from Kane and Silver his last few times out. Just what, what, what does it say about him kind of sticking with it the last couple of years and what he's done? He's a, he's a, he's a veteran. He's savvy. He's, he's, he's all the things he's been here. And, you know, for him to come back when he didn't have to and uh, had some arm injuries last year. We had COVID the year before. So I think maybe he felt like, you know, I just hadn't pitched. You know what I'm saying? I just, yeah, the last couple of years, I felt like I hadn't pitched. And he just, most people, I think, would move on from that and go on. He had a great job back home this summer and when he came back to get his masters and uh, good for him and he's just and, and a lot of his teammates had left like his best buddy Reed Johnson and a lot of his the guys from last year had left so he didn't really know anybody on his team except Devontae and JT and Giles and Souls and a couple people and Sam and them and then for him to come back I said just says volumes about who he is as a person and he's been very very good for us. Especially considering how his tenure in Blacksburg ended, how good was it to see Logan come out and uh, close the game like he did? Yeah, I mean, what happened to him in Blacksburg was very unfortunate and very wrong. Uh, that's uh, that was a travesty. And uh, but he handled the suspension uh, like the human being that he is, and uh, uh, he came back. and I, I know this was special for him, uh, and uh, uh, because. He was very upset about what happened in Blacksburg. Noah Souls is another guy who's been really hot lately. Kind of has bided his time the last couple of years, but seems to be swinging the bat really well. That guy's bided it. Not only has he bided his time, he's been a worker. He's always worked. He's always held his head high, and he's busted his butt to get very good defensively in the outfield. And uh, uh, with the exception of Terrell Tatum last year, nobody gets down the line faster than him. He's just works so hard in his game. So it's always good to see somebody who puts the work in, much as his teammate D. Giles, they're like inseparable. And the way those two work is, is what baseball and what sports are all about. And just see him get rewarded is, uh, is, is fun for a lot of people. Going back to the first game, uh, Villeman was looked absolutely unstoppable down the stretch today. What do you think of him? Well, Villeman's very good, but you know, he, uh, another guy who believes in who he is and and he's, he's put his time in. He works harder. He's gotten his body in shape. He worked hard this summer for Team USA. That was a great experience for him. And uh, his teammates believe him. He believes in himself. And, yeah, he was he was really good because that's the game that – he's done that a couple times now. Did it at Florida State. Did it one more time where the game got extended. He went a little longer than we thought he would go.